This video is all about which next character is coming from One Piece films and which class and element that character will have, how much strong he will be and what's the exact date of this character getting released in OPBR. And is there any other character that will come from One Piece films after this character or now we will talk about that also. Let's get started. Hey this is Kamal welcome back to a new video of One Piece Bounty Rush and as you guys know that a lot of One Piece films characters are coming first Stampede Boa then Strong World Shiki then from One Piece Gold Tezoro and now the new character will be from One Piece Film Z who that will be we will talk about that later but if we remove Boa aside cause Boa was from One Piece Stampede Revival thing or like kind of from a stampede event but this time it is from 3.5 year anniversary celebration campaign hashtag one then this we got on 5 of july on tuesday 3.5 year anniversary celebration campaign hashtag one then we got 3.5 year anniversary celebration campaign hashtag two on july 12 tuesday so the next 3.5 year anniversary celebration campaign hashtag three will be on 19 july on tuesday remember about this date next bounty fest from one piece film is going to be on tuesday on 19th of july we will get the previews and teaser on 18 july but the character will come on 90 july as the update time as always which character that will be if we are not talking about boa boa had the other event so let's not focus on boa why i'm saying that because if you focus on hashtag one hashtag two and hashtag three I know these three go characters were goated, Tezoro was goated, Zephyr, the new character that is coming soon next, he was also goated, and this guy, Shiki was also goated, but all three were villains, all three were literally villains, kind of like a pattern or something. Hmm, can be can be possible if you guys watch my videos already you guys already know that we are talking about Zephyr and what elements and class that character will be having before going for that look at this if we talk about this tezoro and shiki are together also and stampede boa also bullet all movie characters are they are putting together imagine i see if we talk about tezoro tezoro was a blue attacker shiki was a red runner which element is left and which class is left you guys tell me tell me on the comment section what you think that next character is will be which element and class cause blue attacker already done Red runner already done. Which element and class is left? Tell me that on comment section. As you can see that this mofo is blue attacker. This shiki is red runner. Which element is left and which class is left? Only defender class is left and only green element is left. So the next character will be green defender and that will be Zephyr. Zephyr he was called as black arm and he was a marine admiral. You can say a neo, neo marine admiral. He was the founder of neo marine admiral and he was literally really strong. This guy becoming a defender is really really a lot possible and I think 100% chance of him being a green defender plus him coming next in OPBR for sure. There can be a slight chances that there will be no corrector next week. There will be rather there will be no corrector or else there will be this corrector. There is like five or ten percent chance that there will be no corrector on next week, but I think there is eighty to ninety percent chance there is that next corrector will be on next week and that will be Zephyr. I don't buy that there will be any other character other than Zephyr. But you guys think about that. Do you guys agree with me that this mofo will be a green defender and this mofo is coming on 19 July Tuesday or not? Tell me on the comment section. I think that he will be green defender 100%. Why I am saying that he is coming next and why I think that he will be a green defender. We already talked about why he will be green defender when what's the date of this guy coming why this guy will come cause i have seen that opbr kind of i don't want to say that word but opbr does see other games also other mobile games and many times there were many times that that character was already on other games and then opbr brought that character on the game if I talk about which game is that, that game is One Piece Treasure Cruise. This thumbnail I used was from One Piece Treasure Cruise only 
and they release these three mofos together so if i talk about opbr they release shiki they have released tesoro already who is left zephyr is left and literally these three got released on one piece treasure cruise that is literally easy to see that this guy is coming next for sure hundred percent and this guy was blue attacker this guy shiki was red runner so on the element what is left is green and on the class that is left is defender so he will be having a green defender of zephyr black arm zephyr black arm zephyr was really strong you can see this guy was these three came on one piece trailer cruise so it is like 100 percent chance that zephyr is coming next week on 19th of july and being in green defender if i talk about this character this character was really really strong really pog i mean he he kind of like overpowered on full movie although luffy didn't show his full power and all but he was really strong he was called as black arm also and marine admiral come on you guys know that how strong marine admirals are he was a neo marine admiral and the only admiral without devil fruit that's crazy that is literally crazy like being an only character being an admiral without devil fruit that is like as crazy as being in yonko without devil fruit i mean all right uh, wait a second why does both devil fruit characters that are on yonko post and marine admiral post don't have two hands all right let's not talk about that but this guy is called as black arm and he was really really strong really strong a uh, kind of he loki at the start of the movie he kind of like clapped uh kizaru's cheeks now a lot of people will say that nah kizaru was messing around kizaru is always messing around but he was really strong it can be possible that to show him really strong villain they showed that he kind of won against kizaru although he didn't uh clap or beat it kizaru beat it shit out of kizaru but kizaru tried to stop him or tried to capture him but kizaru failed so he he has he has really good potential he will be really strong shiki was really good the tesoro is going crazy uh being released so i think this guy will be like crazy too this guy will be like crazy i think that he will be like really strong and after this character i think either there will be like no other bounty face there will be like directly they're going to one piece film red movie x shanks or as they it can be possible that on 28 july they release fukuro and jabra as we already told that on the prediction video you guys can watch the prediction video also and then either there will be fukuro and jabra and then x shanks x movie shanks or there will be like no bounty fest and directly to the x movie shanks what you think fukuro and jabra coming before x movie shanks or we are going directly to the x movie shanks tell me in the comment section if you guys didn't watch the x movie shanks traits and skills analysis you can check the pinned comment or you can check the description this guy is looking really crazy and he is really really strong i would say that he is going to be crazy he had like really nice armament hockey of this thing and kind of like hand also black arm zephyr was the leader and founder of the neo marines as well as a former marine admiral and instructor before his resignation so that was actually really really cool his appetite of black arm his proficiency with arm and hockey meaning of definitely one of the most powerful marines in history look at that like the others on the list zephyr didn't have any devil fruit power making him the only admiral without one to date that is like really crazy that there is no other admiral without devil fruit to be on the admiral list right now it was the post was on 2020 so do we have any admiral that don't have devil fruit now do we tell me that also on the comment section so that was all about this character zephyr is going to be a green defender coming on 19 july we will get the teaser and preview on 18 july and he will be crazy really strong and he is looking like tanky defender for sure i can see that hand that black arm going crazy against enemies and this guy is going to be good against straw hats most probably most probably most probably against straw hats or most probably against marines also because one guy was against shiki was good against marines the tesoro was googled against straw hats maybe he's good against both of them who knows only time will tell but he will be good against one of them most probably 
extra benefit extra advantage against those characters and then the next on 28 july we will get fukuro and jabra then we will get x movie shank or they will skip fukuro and jabra and just directly go to the movie x shanks that was it all about the video and all about zephyr when zephyr is coming what element class how strong how good shit he will be and what's the exact date he is coming after zephyr if there will be any other move bounty face that will be from one piece films nope uh there will be like from one piece film red that had to be released i'm talking about that that one piece film red will come but between one piece film z to one piece film red there will be no bounty face from one piece films that will come in between fukuro and jabra can come but they are not from one piece films so that's it for the video and thanks for watching this video and don't forget to like and subscribe for more bbr content and for more leaks prediction and 100% logics and new ideas to get hints like that and tell me on the comment section what you guys think all about this video and did you guys enjoy it or not and that's it for today bye guys bye bye